what's up internet uh, welcome to, the, uh, to my channel today I'm going to show you something very unique and very cool is how to modify your or customize your own uh, how to customize your own uh, aliases to add aliases remove aliases stuff like that so the first thing you have to know is which file you have to modify which file you have to modify is always found in the home directory and I'll show you where you can find it ls-a it's a header file of course this one for example this one okay the startup file uh, that we are going to modify it depends it depends on uh, something uh, and it's uh, the uh, program shell which program shell you are using you will find it's uh, on uh, uh, startup file like if you have a bash uh, bash program or using the bash uh, shell uh, you will find that bash rc I'm using the AV shell I'm going to modify the dot bash uh, dot c shell rc alright and how to know which uh, per which uh, program shell you are using just type echo uh, this one right here echo z shell ok just clear this one and the step right now I'm going to show you how to open the file and which, wa which uh, commands you have to edit or remove so I'm going to open the file with a text editor gedit which text editor you guys need to, uh, to use it depends on uh, what you like it doesn't matter open the Z, uh, shell file I'm going to go directly to the uh, aliases I'm going to remove the hashtag to uh, to enable to enable the alias file okay alias command so if I want to uh, disable a command, just add a hashtag. If I want to uh, activate that uh, command, just remove the hashtag. Okay, of course, and save, exit. Next step is to make that source. That file is a source file, uh, like this. Dot C shell RC. does work okay I'm going to remove it right now G edit G edit dot e shell rc go right here edit a hashtag as I told you okay save exit make it source e shell rc it does work, it does work, but we have to exit and start it again. LL does not work and LI does not work. So, you have to make sure, guys, uh, you have to know which uh, program shell you are using because you have to choose the right uh, startup file. It depends on which uh, program shell you are using. This is the first, first thing you need to know. The second thing you have to know is to make a backup for the original file always make a backup for the original files uh, I'll show you how to make it for example copy it's already written uh, make it dot back or dot op doesn't matter uh, as long as it's a backup file uh, the next thing you have to know is there is two type of shells uh, there is the login shell and non login shell and each uh, one has its own uh, startup files so not uh, like uh, modifying a dot z, uh, z shell uh, rc and uh, there is uh, other files like uh, the global configuration files like uh, profile uh, which found in uh, slash etc slash uh, profile and uh, some other files we will see in uh, some next videos okay for uh, okay for now uh, this is it uh, that's how you added uh, some Alices or remove some. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, have a good day and stay safe. Bye.